there's a big difference with that <laughs> at the end. That little, <laughs> the phlegm says it all, you know? <laughs> Quiet on set. Camera. Rolling. Sound. Speed. And action. Film nerds, good friends, and old roommates get together to talk about books. books? Welcome to the Film Nerd Book Club. Can't wait for you to read with us. Is, Is this, this recording? recording? <laughs> <laughs> we got Sanji, we got Mika, we got Evie, and we got Josh and me, of course, Jess. I don't think I ever introduced myself, but it's okay. We, we know who I am. <laughs> we know my role in the group. <laughs> Do we? Uh, I, I know, know you're everybody, role apparently. apparently. <laughs> Can I just uh, say that I feel really, really stupid because I just got the pun of Jess's oh name God. underneath. I just got it right uh, now. <laughs> So, as Jess said, this is a spoiler-free review of Mexican Gothic by Silvia Morena Garcia. Mexican, Mexican Gothic. A spoiler review. Spoiler-free. Spoiler-free. Spoiler Why do I keep doing that? The spoiler-free <laughs> review of Mexican Gothic. It's like she's buying free. <laughs> <laughs> Or is it free to be by? I want to break free. I want to break free. What are your guys' thoughts? Yeah. Now that we are done. Uh, on the book Maybe, or in no. general? That was a on one syllable favorite. review by Jess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Maybe go because um, I know I'm going to have to my, cut you off. My thoughts on the book or in general? Your book, in general, book. why are you asking questions that you know the answers to? <laughs> <laughs> Is uh, your video already, using your head a little bit I've, too much? I've already yeah. made it clear over the course of this video series and this book that I think this book was awesome. It was great. It hit all the points that I was looking for in something horror related throughout October, and I was really horror happy. Horror-related. No, horror <laughs> Horror. 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 <laughs> okay, so Guys, if you... I know how to speak good. God. Oh, God. Okay, yes, mm -hmm. you really do. Overall, what would you? What rating would you give it? Uh, I would give it a good 10 uh, peppers out of 10. <laughs> I love that you said peppers. I love so... it, yeah, but... Yeah, that's our rating right, system now. Rating. Oh, forever moving should, forward. Should the forever. rating be tens or fives, though? I've always felt that maybe tens are too many numbers. How about it depends on how much you love the book? Out of five, you give it a ten. I All right, out of five, I give it <sighs> ten habaneros. <laughs> Woo! Jess, did you want to stick by your first comment? <laughs> yes. Ew. So, ew. ew. And what was the rating for ew? It was not ew. It was ick. Oh, ugh. Sorry, it was one. No, 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 there's a big, like... there's a big difference with that <laughs> at the end. That little, <laughs> the phlegm says it all, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I'll give it. Uh, is it? I'll, I'll give it a one out of five. One pepper. Yeah, that's low. A single. Uh, okay, pepper? fine. A two out of five. <laughs> a pepper. What are those what, small what peppers? Kind of, what kind of pepper? Oh. Um, I don't know. Banana pepper. Did you do that to a banana pepper? I know those are awesome. <laughs> those are my favorite. You just like just wait. Wait. I just said a random pepper, guys. <laughs> we I said a pepper we... first. Okay. <laughs> Joshy. Well, um, this one is hard because I. <laughs> appreciate I know I tried so I see look I had better composure than Jess I'm very proud of that for the first time for everything this is why I'm not on screen <laughs> because right earlier here. when Jess introduced Josh it said the bottom I wanted to say something but I couldn't because I wanted to stay professional yeah that's me are we the bottom. Are anyway we? um Ay, Dios. Ya se me olvidó todo. <laughs> what were we even talking about? Okay, I need your overall opinion on the book okay. yeah. and a but rating. Over... Okay, so this one's hard to grade for me because horror is not my thing. Like, I did not enjoy the process of reading a lot of this book, but I still think the writing on it was great. So, like, on its merit, I give it, like, a, like a five-star, but on my enjoyment, it's, like, a two. 
So I guess I'm going to just settle in the middle and say it's a three star for me. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, you rounded up. I mean, I feel like that's rounding up. You gave it more than I thought. Because I okay. really do love, like, the... I love the themes that were explored, how she laid them out. Um, I think that she is doing some important things in the story. I just, it's not a thing that I particularly enjoy. That's just what it is. Like, again, if I'm yeah, just evaluating fair. the writing, for me, it was like a four to five star book. But like, on my enjoyment, it's much lower because I didn't enjoy it. That's super fair. And there's like, there's a, there's a well fine put. line between the uh, the subject matter versus the quality of true portraying yes. the subject matter. Yes. Sanji, what do you think? Oof. I Oof. have to go with Evie. It was I like horror. I like watching a lot of horror movies and it was I did like the reading even though it's a slow start, but it was easy for me to read, easy to follow along and just the imagery it was like watching the movie it was like the details and i liked all the twists i like there were some disgusting things that i have to say i did get really disgusted by but it it got me to that point that i did feel disgusted so bravo they <laughs> what was rating able... would you give it um i would have to say five out of five like it was Woo! it was it was good like I, I really liked it. I can't wait for it to be on a TV series. <laughs> so I'd have to... Okay, so I can agree with um, each and every one of you on certain things. Jess, yes. Uh, 100%. <laughs> I agree. Um, like, it, Josh, probably I feel more along the lines of uh, your thoughts because I'm so not a horror person, but I do have to say it kind of... For me, not being a horror person, the thing that I didn't like was how fantastic the imagery is because <laughs> yeah. I hmm. felt it was too much for me to handle. Like I was like, uh, no, because if this was a movie and I could see it clearly in my brain because of how well written it was, I did not like it because it's not my thing. And um, it was creepy and weird and I didn't like it. But I guess I guess it did its job. <laughs> Uh, so I mean, if you, would, you enjoy it, can be so wrong and like out of context. <laughs> Every conversation I have, I feel like can be taken out of context. I feel like every episode, Always. you just like didn't know. I know. I will have to say this though. So, like, judging it by its cover, I love the color, <clears throat> the cover of the book, and it yes. makes me want to love it because I feel like the cover actually does a really good job in like. Everything. I don't know. I just feel like its imagery, its actual imagery on the cover matches the imagery that it creates when you're reading it in your head. It's very vivid. Picture it. Sicily, 1912. Like, it's been a while since I read a book that I really could, be, from start to finish, I did not have, a tr I did not have trouble Im imagining any part of it. Mm -hmm. I think when we read... Um, you didn't have trouble re like, reiterating what you felt. <laughs> Ouch. Um, when we read oh, when we read um, If We Were Villains, I feel like the only really good imagery in those parts were um, when they were performing. Yeah, the stage. And, the yeah. But like this whole book, I felt like it was very much like I was there yeah. the whole time. And I didn't enjoy being there the whole time. <laughs> Well, that's how you know. I, would give, I would give it I would have to find somewhere in the middle because it wouldn't be fair for me to be like this because I didn't enjoy it yeah. like the actual subject matter it would be like one it was well pepper, but it is but well written like so I feel like I should give it 2.5 peppers it, it <laughs> does a good so you agree. it does sorry go just no so she agrees like yeah it's well written but ugh. <laughs> yeah, it has to be your thing, I think. I think it's just one of those, you know, hit or miss.
my god why was that the hardest thing i said ever? 